हेलो एवरी वन टूडे ऑन सिक्रेट एनिमल हॉर्स ब्रीडिंग यूट्यूब चैनल शोइंग वीडियोज ऑन लाइफ कवर हॉर्स ब्रीडिंग लाइफ कवर मीन्स स्टेलियन माउंट्स अ मेल एंड इंसर्ट हिज पीनस इन टू द फीमेल हॉर्स एंड इजैकुलेट्स लाइफ कवर अकर्स नेचुरली और इज मैनेज थ्रू इन एंड ब्रीडिंग इन ब्रीडिंग इज द मोस्ट कॉमन ऑफ थरो ब्रेड हॉर्सेज मोस्ट कमर्शियल ब्रीडर्स है फैसिलिटी डिजाइन फॉर मीटिंग द एरिया इज टिपिकल लार्ज इनफ टू अलाउ द मूवमेंट ऑफ द हॉर्स एंड पीपल विथ क्लीन नॉन स्लिप फ्लोरिंग The life cover proceeds when the broodmen display signs of ovulation. A veterinarian can run tests to determine which day and time will make conception the most likely. When a mare is ready, she is brought into the breeding shed and teased. Teasing is using a stallion to encourage her to get ready to the breed. Most horses in heat will lean toward the stud, raise their tails, squat and urinate. They are physical signs the mare is ready for mounting. Now the mare is ready for breeding. The stallion is brought to the restrained broodmare for mounting. He should be led with a long lead shank. He should be given time to smell, taste and nuzzle the mare he prevented from the mounting her until he has a full erection. Once he is fully erect now the stallion to mount the horse and breed her. Be vigilant during the dismount frequently a mare will act aggressively and kick at the stallion. Breeding management on a large farm is complicated and should only be undertaken by trained personnel. Many horse breeding organization allow offspring conceived through artificial insemination to register. Life cover breeding is not required for either standard breed or quarter horse registration. The most common reason is the artificial insemination dilutes the gene pool and creates inferior horses. Inferior mares would have access to semen through AI that they don't have under the current rules. Reproduction by the inferior mares will result in an abundance of low quality horses. The most desirable stallions are used to provide semen. Limiting the breed pool means there is a real risk that certain bloodlines will dominate the genetic pool and decrease diversification. Over time, the lack of diversity could devastate to the thorough breed. The decrease in stud fees is another real risk. Supply and demand artificial insemination will increase supply and reduce a stud's cost. Subscribe and turn on notifications so you don't miss amazing facts, horse videos of horse breeding. Check out this playlist of horse donkey breeding, and I will see you in the next video. Take care.